Ruth here, and I got this surprise letter package thingy from Dark Magician 81. And I did have a quick peek inside because I wasn't actually sure because he didn't say he was sending me anything. Um, or if he did, I completely forgot. But um, in passing, let me check. In passing, I commented on one of these videos saying, I think, along the lines of, like, if you're going to throw them away, why not uh, send them to me? Because I stick them in my scrapbook. So, he sent me some path art and, ooh, some cards, too. So, that's, that's pretty. Man, I want ice cream now. <laughs> um... Just flying backwards there. And that's a very nice one. I forgot what it's called in English, but it is awesome. Sweet. Now in total, I think I have like only six holographic Japanese cards for review because I don't really go out and buy them because yeah I spend most of my money on the English stuff so anyway that is lovely now it does annoy me when Konami has to um, censor some of the uh, cards like for instance Harpy Lady I think it's censored, at least one of them or something. And um, Dark Magician Girl, or one of the Dark Magician Girls, or just a few of them are censored as well in the English version, which is kind of annoying, but there we go. And so thank you so much for sending these, well, sending all of these, but sending these as well. Awesome. Put that here for now. So here we have some Yu-Gi-Oh and Pokemon. So here we have a Legendary Duelist, White Dragon Abyss. I'm a bit behind on some of the Yu-Gi-Oh and two, I think, sets of the Pokemon, but uh, lovely addition to my collection. And a Unified Minds Japanese Pokemon pack. That's awesome. There's some Mew and Mewtwo action going on. Lovely. So cool. I don't know why the English doesn't have like the set symbols on the packet because that's cool. That's yes, really cool. And we have some sun and moon base. I am putting it in the camera, right? <laughs> we got some Detective Pikachu. Burning Shadows. And we've got a uh, dual power, which I haven't opened this box yet, that has these in it. So that's awesome and great dark magician there. He's one of the cooler cards, I think. Him and Dark Magician Girl I think are my favorites. Though I do like the spellcasters in general. Here we have a uh, 20th anniversary legendary co legend collection Japanese set. That is super cool. Very nicely intact as well. Awesome. We've got a uh, The Dark Side of Dimensions movie pack. Battles of Legend, Light's Revenge. You know what? I'm not 
Did I have I even opened one of these before? I can't remember. That legendary duelist Ancient Millennium with Pegasus there. That Storm of Ragnarok. I do like the uh, Norse cards. They're cool. Oh, uh, that's Cybernetic Horizon. Soul Fusion, which I don't know if I opened it. Gladiator's Assault, which is a very old one. And don't say how old it is on here. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Does it say? Probably not, actually. But this is the, like a very old. Well, you can you can tell it's old because. Well, I don't know. It's just. You can tell. I mean, that's a newer one, and that's an older one. Oh, one way I guess you could tell is the uh, Yu-Gi-Oh logo, because all of them are like that now. By the looks of it, and this is like an old, old one. But anyway, that's cool. And this is an obviously a super well old <laughs> for U.S. and Canada English edition. Magician's Force. And that's cool. And that's not the Dark Magician, right? That's... Who was it? I mean, it's not the Magician of Chaos. It's some other magician, I forgot. Ooh, which one was it? I'm pretty sure I have a card of him, probably. Like, well, a newer version of him. But yeah. All those magicians are super cool. Anyway, yes, that was awesome. All these. And most of them I don't have, I think. If I do, I'll just stick in a different scrapbook anyway. But yeah. Awesome. Super cool, that one. Because, like, obviously I don't go out and buy Japanese packs. I do wonder sometimes are the Japanese packs more expensive than the English ones? I don't know. But anyway, it is very cool. So thank you so much for all of these pack arts and for the cards and that's awesome and thanks. And I just have to figure out which which scrapbook to put it in. I mean I could put it in the the U Pokemon and the Pokemon one and the U and the Yu-Gi-Oh one, which I don't think I have one. I think I already filled that one. But um or just stick it in your section. <laughs> the the letter you wrote me last time is in a isn't actually the Pokemon scrapbook, which is almost full, so... Yeah. Anyway. This is all awesome. I just... Yeah. I wasn't even expecting it, because I totally forgot if you actually did tell me. I don't think you told me you were sending me anything. Because I had no clue. I was like... So also, it's very nice stamps. You know, in all of the uh, international stamps I've gotten, for some reason I never actually got a US flag stamp, which is kind of strange. I always got that green rose thing, you know. But, yeah, anyway, obviously I'm, I'm gonna put those bits out. I'm strange like that. So, like, two. Why not, you know? Ooh, it's got a uh, Mark C 2018. So I guess that's when they designed these car these uh, stamps. Anyway, yeah. So I'll be sticking this in my scrapbook next to packs, I guess. Might as well, you know? It's very nice stamps, too. Yeah. 
Um, I'll definitely send you something for Christmas, right? I just have to think what to send you. <laughs> or something. So yeah, that is everything. And it came right on time because I have nothing for nothing uploaded for next week except for some of the Wednesdays that I've managed to resurrect some of the blind bag Wednesday videos and yeah oh, and on a complete side note all the filler, the rest of the filler episodes that I recorded I think I forgot to save them on my hard drive so they're probably in this digital scrap heap on my old and only laptop. I'm currently borrowing my sister's. Um, yeah, so, and I, I was only on, like, filler episode, I don't know what number, like, 12 or something, and I had 30 in total, so that's a bummer. <laughs> but I already uploaded all of those, a picture of all of those, uh, cards that I pulled in my album on my Facebook anyway, so if you want to have a browse through all cards or whatever, I'm currently on like folder number five or something, or four, on my Facebook, so if you want to look at those cards, go be, be my guest, um, but yes, this is so pretty. Doesn't he look so cute? Anyway, I'm just jabbering on for like 12 minutes. So, that is everything. So, thank you for watching. Like and subscribe for more. Ring the bell for notifications. Oh, and do check out Dark Magician 81. His channel, great videos. His giveaways are awesome as well. And his um, Instagram, right? Yes, his Instagram as well. Check out all those. I'll do a, um, what's it? Yes, links in the description box below for his Instagram and his YouTube. And I think that was the only thing. There were only those two, I think. And I do check, check out his videos and his Instagram. I said that like three times now. But anyway, do check them out. Anyway, over and out.